Hi, I'm Dr. Susan Sklar. I'm the founder and medical director of the Sklar Center for Restorative Medicine. I am a 21st century physician who combines ancient wisdom with the latest in scientific technology to optimize your health naturally. And today I'm going to talk to you about recovery from stress, specifically the stress of post-contest figure athletes. You can have stress of a variety of causes, and we'll go into that later, but I know that the physical and mental challenges of a physical athlete put your body in a stress response similar to some of the most severe stress responses humans can undergo. What I want to explain to you is what your stress response is and how you can recover from it and regain the balance in your life. Our stress response, and stress can be from good things like participating in an athletic competition or from things that are not good like loss of a loved one, a boss at work who is making your life miserable, having too many things to juggle in your life. I would say that almost everybody is under some sort of significant stress in their lives. It's the rare person who is not physically or mentally stressed. But specifically, we're going to talk about figure athletes and the type of rigorous training you undergo, the loss of body fat, the diet that you use, and the um, exercise requirements that get you to where you want to be as a figure athlete. These create tremendous changes in your body, um, and sometimes that lack of balance will cause problems after a contest you will be able to completely recover from whatever changes have gone on as a result of your athletic endeavors. And I want to tell you how to make that road easier. Our adrenal glands are responsible for our physiologic stress response. And those are two glands that sit on top of the kidneys and produce a number of different uh, chemicals. One of the most important chemicals is cortisol. Cortisol is the main hormone that is part of our physiologic stress response. And no matter what the cause of the stress is, whether it's uh, your boss yelling at you, or you get held up at gunpoint, or you've been caretaking somebody very ill, or you've just been training for four to six months for a contest, the physiologic response in your body is just about the same. Now, this physiologic response, um, back when men evolved, when the human race evolved, was a life-saving response. Unfortunately, if it goes on for a long time, if it's on a chronic basis, which is months and months if you're training for a contest, you can actually have some undesirable changes in your body that need to be uh, addressed. And those need to be, uh, those imbalances need to be restored and rebalanced. We developed this physiologic response to stress as part of our body's reaction to life-threatening danger. And in our evolution, usually that life-threatening danger was due to um, a wild animal wanting to come and eat us. When that happens, our body stops, stops all building activities, and focuses on releasing cortisol and producing sugar so that our brains and muscles can function optimally for that short duration of time that we're in tremendous danger. Getting out of that danger, during evolution generally required a burst of physical activity, running, climbing, swimming, to get out of danger. And then once the danger was over, that tremendous stress response, that physiologic change and release of cortisol stopped and our body restored. That burst of physical activity was part of the restoration. Today in modern society, our bodies respond as if we were under threat from a wild animal almost 24 hours a day. The more stress you have in your life, the more you have that response going on. And if you've been training for a contest, you've spent hours a day exercising. You have limited your diet. You have cut down your body fat. All of these things contribute to loss of hormones and stress on the adrenal glands in an effort to keep your body healthy. We're going to talk in the next segments about how to know if you have adapted to that stress or not and what you can do to recover from it.